Hi there. Welcome to this week's episode of Market Watch. I'm Hansen, branch manager at Philip Investor Center. Today, I'll be sharing on electric vehicle industry. To promote the adoption of electric vehicle, EV in Singapore, Singapore Green Plan 2030 is introduced. HDB car parks in at least eight towns will be fitted with EV charges by 2025. By 2030, it is targeted to have at least 60,000 EV charging points across Singapore's public car parks and private premises. Incentives are also given to EVs through the rebate of additional registration fee, ARF, in the EV early adopter incentive as well as vehicle emission scheme. Other than in Singapore, EVs are also getting embraced globally with more than 10 million EVs in the market, representing about 1% of total vehicle stock in 2020. The EV market grew more than 40% in 2020 amidst the global pandemic, while global car sales dropped 16%, with around 3 million EVs registered in 2020. According to a report by International Energy Agency, IEA, EV sales were resilient to the three main reasons. Supportive regulatory framework, with many countries having policies targeting emission standards. Additional incentive to safeguard EV sales from economic downturn and Mr. Pandemic, such as China's delaying the phase-out of its subsidy scheme for EV purchases. The number of EV models expanded while battery costs continue to fall, providing a wider range of options for consumers at a lower cost. Consumer spending on electric vehicle, electric car purchases increased to USD 120 billion in 2020, out of which government across the world spent USD 14 billion to support electric car sales. The near-term outlook for EV sales remained bullish, where Q1 2021 saw EV Global EV sales increased by 140% compared to Q1 2020. China has the largest fleet at 4.5 million electric cars, while Europe, which have overtook China in the largest annual increase in 2020, reached 3.2 million electric cars. Tesla, arguably the most known brand for EVs, faces strong competition in China, where one little known automaker dominated the world's largest electric car market. Hong Kong Mini from SAIC, GM Uling Automobile Co., a joint venture between SAIC Motocom, Guangxi Automobile Group, and US giant General Motors, sold around 270,000 cars within nine months, making it the best selling EV in China. EV industry remains highly competitive and will likely be a mega trend in short to medium term, with the push for new emission standards across the world. Investors should find out more before investing in the industry. I hope you have enjoyed this episode of Market Watch. Do remember to like and follow us on social media and subscribe to us on YouTube. Do also leave a comment to share with us which EV brand you will buy, if applicable in Singapore. Thank you for joining us and see you again.